Is it even bright enough? No, it isn't. You idiot. <laughs> what are you watching me? Hi everyone, welcome back to The Average. Um, today we have a cool thing that I got, so give me one second. Professional. <laughs> I have here... Six kilos of art supplies that Artex kindly sent to me and um, super grateful but we're gonna unbox this now for you guys. Me and Pesto, apparently. Okay, you get off. <laughs> Sorry Pesto, I feel bad. Uh, let's get to doing this. This is my career now. This is what I do. I'm like one of those cool YouTubers that unboxes stuff. Can you tell? Did you for me? What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Whoa. Okay, let's look at this. There is loads of stuff in here and I'm super excited. Um, ah, it feels like Christmas morning. What the? <laughs> so I've got all these different packages. So let's just take these out and then I can film over top. But yeah. One. Two. Six massive packages. Thank you so much, Hot Check. This is crazy. Look, Pessie, you can have this. <laughs> That's a thumbnail. Oh, that is a crazy amount of, crazy amount of pen. Watching in the cat are playing behind me. So let's open this first package. Whoa, okay, so alcohol-based ink, brush tip, 24 markers. So I've got 24 of those. So I'm not really sure what the difference is between the boxes, maybe like colours of pens or maybe style of pens, I'm not sure yet. Um, let's see, we've got this red batch. I don't know if they're like reds, yellows, etc. Um, but yeah, there's like a, a red feel to this one. It's the same kind of box and then obviously this one is going to be probably the same again. But different, <laughs> same but different. Same but different. Got so much bubble wrap. I will save the bubble wrap, I think, somehow. Oh gosh. Whoa, awesome. Okay, so 24 unique colours, and this is the same set? No, they're slightly different. This one's got wavies, and this one's got a thingy. Pesto's excited too. Okay, these are looking like grey coloured ones, maybe? But I'm just guessing that from the box because it doesn't actually say on the box what type of, excuse me, pesto uh, thing we're dealing with. So we've got four of these sets, which is pretty crazy. You guys know that I really like using alcohol markers and it says it has a brush tip. And that was kind of my problem with the last set of alcohol markers from Artex was that they had like that chisel tip, which I'm not like a big fan of. Oh my gosh. Ooh, it's a hot day as well. This is crazy. I'm not getting over this. Like, being sent free stuff by companies is oftentimes really awesome. So being sent this much by you guys, by Artex, is like phenomenal. I'm so excited. And yeah, I probably will use all of these because I all my alcohol markers that I bought recently, well, I got gifted these ones. Most of them have run out from doing the comics and I tend to like making my comics with alcohol markers so this is awesome. Um, and then the last one and that's the last one which is 32 colours. So they all pretty much have the same stuff so I'm probably just going to go over that again. But let's get to opening, I want to open this red one and let's look inside to see what we have because ee, I'm excited. I can't believe this, it's so cool. I'm just getting like inspired now to like, trying to think of where I'm gonna put all these pens as well. Cause I don't have much space and my art cupboard is full. So I think there needs to be an organizational video coming up. I might go to Ikea and pick out like something that I can fashion into a pen stand. Sorry about that. How cool would that be? Like a whole studio with just pens. Who's up from the front? Whoa. Huh? 
They look so cute with this little thing. I don't understand. Oh, it comes with a tray. <gasps> nice. Stickers, all Beauty Lasts Forever, and a little swatch patch, which I will not use because me and swatches, we don't, we just don't get along that way. Like, so, a little card. Artex are the company that sent me all this stuff. There's a little stand here, so it's got like a yellow compartment thing. Uh, is this video gonna... Oh, I'm looking a bit pasty. Looking a bit pasty there. Okay, whatever. Whatever, guys, you're gonna have to do. That's the only thing I would comment on if these guys could like maybe think about their plastic usage, but then also yeah, it's a, it's a big topic. So we get this little stand. There's another one here. It comes with this bag. Oh my gosh, so cute. So you can carry it around the pens. I probably wouldn't do that though. Gift receipt. So it's just like a, it's a really weird texture. It's like a straw bag. It's cute, it's cute. I like it. It's like a little bum bag thing. Quite like that probably won't put my pens in it but I might carry something else in it and then here are the pens <gasps> so they are all like pinks they're all pinks and reds guys I'm so happy I could cry that is so cool look at that and you get a little stand with it so how's it gonna go like this <gasps> the options the options guys what am I gonna do with all these pens <laughs> I need like a studio space, I only have my desk. So they all go in like that, pretty nice. They all have that cool like wave design that I liked before. So they have like this weird pattern and then the colours at the top and the numbers of what it is which is really cute. And the chisel tip and the brush tip. <gasps> okay what I'm gonna do is go through these quickly, unpack them so you can look at the colours and then we'll swatch some. But I am Trez Excite. Trez Excite, just never said that in my whole life. This is awesome, I, oof, okay, I keep saying the same thing, I'm gonna calm it down. So I'm assuming this is a pack of yellows. Well, okay, so we got the same deal again, papers, another bag, but this time it's different color. That's so awesome. So this time we got like a little yellow design. I honestly don't, think I would carry my pens in this but actually it would be quite good to store them like that wouldn't it instead of just you know keeping a hundred pens on my desk so maybe I'll put them in the cupboard uh, with these little baggies super cute got a whiff there doesn't smell good but it doesn't matter I'm happy oh these are greens not yellows what do they do with yellow then <laughs> There's some light yellow and greens. Oh my gosh, so beautiful. So beautiful. I am excited. Can you tell that I'm hyped, guys? Can you tell? Because I am. And this one then, I'm guessing is the yellows because that was, was green even though it had yellow packaging. We've got the same packaging, the stickers and the little boxes. It's a shame that these aren't different colours, but you get yellow and blue. And you get another bag. Or I get, well, I get another bag. Okay, so they're like... Ooh, this one's different. I like that. Everyone is immersed in art. Art is never monotonous. Hmm, don't know about that. Maybe we should touch, try graphic design. Because <laughs> that can be monotonous sometimes. Anyway, ooh, so many blues. I just need a moment. I just need a moment. I'm gonna make so much dang art that you are gonna be impressed with with, with that situation. Uh, and the last set of the smaller box, which I'm assuming must be greys, because, because it's coming in a black box. And the other ones came in sort of colored skinny things. Oh my gosh. Eww. Why did I open it this way? Again, we get the same sort of 
thingy happening with the pamphlets? Do we get two different colour stickers? No. So, ah, yeah, yeah, sort of, I think. Hmm. More stands. Excellent, because I need them. I need stands now. Oh, I like this bag. Ooh, that one's cool. Look at that style. Such style, such class. Can you see me walking around town with my pens in my bag? Like, reflecting in your eye. <laughs> no, that is cool though. I think I will probably put some pens in storage that won't be on my desk because if I have all the pens on the desk, ah! I thought this was going to be black and white, but it's loads of pinks. I'm so happy. Look at those colours. I can't even describe to you the words that I'm feeling. I thought this was going to be greys and I was not interested. I was like, well, I was because greys are cool as well, but I'm more interested in colours, as you guys can probably guess from my colourful Okay, and on to the big boy, the big 32 pack. I'm guessing, although I have been known to be wrong in the past, that this, this one, this one is grey. Greys and blacks. Possibly. Nothing like the fine feeling of cracking open a big box of pens. Okay, so same again. Same old drill. Swatchy thing that I will never use because... Uh, I just don't like using them and I think I did peek the colours that these are greys but yeah they are whoa this bag is really neat it's like a big zipper okay I'll open this one for the plastic because this one looks like a cool like pencil case pencil case bag it looks like that like re recycled plastic material again that's cool actually I really like that it says Artex on it which is the brand yeah, that's that's pretty cool. It's like a big beefy, big beefy. I, this box, I can't with this box. Big beefy boy. Okay, and then you can put all your pens in here. This will be good for me. This will be good for me. I need organization. And it comes with this little strap as well that says Artex on it. That's pretty neat. I mean, I don't know how much these pens cost, but if I bought like a load of pens and then it came with a bag like a pencil case like this, I. I think that's pretty neat and this little stands as well which is I was gonna say neat again no nah. not gonna say it again but yeah these are all the greys there's some cool greys and some not so cool greys this looks like a drawing with waffles video doesn't it with all these pens I could do that now I could do it guys <laughs> that is a giant amount of pens I can't wait to test these out. That looks like a really... I know, I know I'm pretty much being just like Artex hype man right now, but this is... They sent me this. I don't... I can be honest with my review, so... This chisel, I uh, mean brush tip, looks really nice and spongy. So, I'm looking forward to trying them out. And the last box of this Christmas, mini Christmas for me. I can't even think what this could be because... It must just be like more colours, but I've got all the pinks, all the reds, all the blues. I've caught them all. Got to catch them all. I'm a Pokemon master now, but with pens. You see what I'm doing here? You see the analogy I'm making? Same thing again. That we always know it's gonna be. Okay, pamphlets. We know what they are. What's the bag this time? Ooh, I actually really like that bag the best. I think. That bag is cool. I like the style of it. It's like kind of 80s. It's not. It's not. Look how cool. Oh, it's like a little, I don't know, like a little buckety, buckety. Yeah, very 80s style. I like that. The pens in there would be a nightmare though. Can you imagine? They'll be like all over the place. Just going to town, guys. My new designer art text bag what this jealous this old thing it's nothing it's just i'm gonna stop 
I'm gonna stop doing that. And let's look at the pens. Okay, I'm not sure if they're different colors from what I've had in the other boxes, but they seem to be, oh, I see. Browns and yellowy, mustardy, all the gross colors that I'm wearing right now. No, they're not gross. They're just like, uh, they're just those colors that I rarely use, but often need so thank you very much and uh yes oh my gosh super excited i if you guys like a certain set as well it's kind of interesting to see the color schemes that they put them into so like this is like muddy greens browns yellows and then this one is all the grays and the pinks i'm very excited about the pinks and the reds and the purples i'm gonna set them up and then i'll film them all together Help me, am I being dumb? I can't figure out how to do this. I don't understand. Oh, it comes with a tray. Oh, nice. It comes with a little stand and you get some stuff. So I've made these stands, right? Yeah. And I'm like, okay, they must go like that. No. No. Oh, they must go like that. Mm -hmm. But then it fell. Yeah, they go like that. Oh. <laughs> Why did it fall? But when it when I was doing it by myself, they kept falling. Put it in the middle. Yeah. I feel like that's really like gonna fall over when I'm picking pens out. I think what I'll do is I'll just stand them like this. Yeah, I think it's handy as well. Sorry, little them, cases. If you stand them all next to each other, cute as you are. You can always glue them on. True. Is the crazy amount of pens that Artex kindly gifted me today. Um, I think I'll do some swatches, but I won't be. Um, <coughs> sorry, I won't be drawing anything today. I think I'll do like a part two for that. Um, if you guys are interested to see how these do for like a proper drawing, um, I'll just swatch some just so you guys see. Even though I said I would never do swatching, but yeah, just so you guys can see what they look like whilst being used. Unfortunately, I couldn't really figure out the stands. I felt like they didn't really work for, m for my desk. Like, I feel like it's kind of cool. I don't know, they're a bit, it's a bit flimsy, so I'll try it out, but I'm not sure. I've uh, got this random page here where I'm doing some doodles. So I'll just do some swatches for you of stuff. So here is a light blue. This one is 182. And I would say that the tops, they do kind of match what's going on in the image. So I can tell that this is gonna get really messy for me having all these pens. They go down nice. They bleed a little bit, which is fine uh, on this paper kind of nice they feel really good the brush tips feels really like quite sturdy but soft as well the point of alcohol markers if you don't know is that they can blend together quite easily because it has alcohol in it so you don't get the, those kind of lines that you get um, with like felt tip pens for instance so you get a really smooth layered down color which is really nice and they layer like really nicely these are awesome and I'm so so happy so thank you so much to Artex for gifting me these pens um, you guys are insane and thank you so much I think these look so good I'm stay tuned for like me using them in the future because I will definitely be drawing a lot with these because I love alcohol markers and I think yeah these will definitely get used I'm really happy to have received these and I hope that you guys enjoyed this unboxing even though it's just an unboxing not really an art making video um, I still hope you guys liked it so like and subscribe for more content if you please and I will see you next time oops <laughs> typical bye